hey my darlings welcome back to my channel for those who are new welcome my name is timby and for those who are returning my day ones welcome thank you so much for coming back so today's video i am showing you guys my wash day hair routine so these are all the products that i use i mostly use mizani products um same as my relaxer i use mizani so first of all i moisturize my hair the night before so my wash day is in two parts or rather it's in two days so the night before i moisturize so here i'm using my leave-in conditioner i will list all the prices below and then the and then i go in with my night um what do you call my night serum okay it's not serum my night cream so it's like a mask for your hair it is so good for your hair because it brings in all the moisture um it also locks in the moisture of your hair it strengthens your hair strands and you want to make sure that the ends are also well moisturized because that's where you need most of the moisture because the hair strands are too far away from your scalp so they don't get to get all the moisture from the scalp so as you can see i am moisturizing my entire hair and making sure that i touch on all the hair strands that are on my hair on my head <laughs> um i hope everyone has been keeping well i know i have been away for a couple of days i was just settling in in my new job as i had mentioned i started a new job so that's why i haven't been posting as much but it's been two weeks of me being in my new job so i should be fine now and i will be posting a little bit more and thank you so much guys for helping me grow my channel i see some of you are reposting you are sharing um and i'm hoping that you're also telling your friends your cousins your family members everyone who's got an ear to listen about my channel um yeah thank you so much guys and thank you for your continued support i truly truly appreciate it you do not even understand how much i appreciate it i'm not sure why um it looks like i've got a spot at the back of my head <laughs> but trust me i don't <laughs> i don't but i think it's how i opened the lines i didn't like open like straight straight lines so once i'm done i make sure that i use my shower cap and my bonnet to lock in all the moisture and just heat my head up and this is how i go to sleep so the following day i wake up and i go back to washing my hair i did say that i use mostly mizani products um for my night mask and my my live-in conditioner i also use mizani and before you wash your hair you want to make sure that you brush it out you make sure that you don't have any knots on your hair or um it's not tangled so i use my detangling brush as you can see um if you've got another detangler that you can use you can use it but for me this works perfectly fine i got it from this came i think i got it for like 50 rands it wasn't it wasn't expensive and i know it's definitely less than 100 rands i just can't remember i've had it for so long and another thing that is quite interesting i would like for you guys to try is for me i don't use combs that much i mostly use this tangling brush because i don't comb out my 
my hair growth meaning the the bottom part of my hair that is close to my scalp i don't i i don't comb it out at all and it, it works perfectly fine for me so i hope you guys also try it out so then i go in with my hair scalp um or hair scrub or scalp scalp scrub oh english i go in with my scalp scrub so i use i try and scrub my hair i would say maybe twice a month i don't use it like all the time when i'm washing my hair i regularly wash my hair i would i would wash my hair like every week or every other week but i don't use the scrub like all the time when i'm washing my hair so the benefits of the scrub is that it removes all the build up this is the scrub that i use i bought it from the body shop um it's the tea tree scalp it smells divine and it's so beautiful on your hair it leaves your hair feeling so clean and so fresh and even your scalp feeling so fresh so going back to the benefits i use the scalp mostly because i want to get rid of the build up um from the moisturizer that i would have used in between my washes i also try and not moisturize my hair that often i'll skip like maybe two days in between moisturizing my hair um, because I believe the scalp is quite good at moisturizing your hair and you don't want your hair to be greasy and yeah and have built up on your scalp because that's what causes dandruff and another benefit that the scalp the scalp scrub has is that it also gets rid of the dandruff and if you're like me you have very very dry skin it also helps with that um it's it also is written on the thingy on the scalp scrub that it also helps with moisturizing your scalp as much as it's getting rid of build up from your hair from your scalp so this is how i go in i want to buy a scrub brush a what a scalp brush <laughs> where's my english this morning i want to buy a a scalp brush just to massage my head when i am washing my hair so basically what i'm doing right now i want to make sure that i massage my scalp um just to stimulate my hair cuticles and massage them and thank them for helping me grow my hair and you want to be gentle with this part just don't go ham on your scalp just massage it out you can also use your fingers to massage don't use your nails please you don't want to scrape out your scalp because that's not good for your Hair cuticles nor is it good for your hair growth um, and I want to say this time I'm focusing on my hair growth I know I've been cutting my hair quite regularly um, and I want to try and not do that so that's why I'm making sure that I take care of my hair as much as I possibly can because when I see that it's not looking like how I would want it to look, that's when I want to cut it. And that's when I cut my hair. So this time I'm quite intentional about not cutting my hair and let it grow out. And plus I want to see how long can it get. Um, I believe that my hair can get quite long because of how rapid it, um, it grows like it grows quite quickly um I, I won't lie it grows quite quickly i will cut it like for instance i had cut my hair in the other video when i had relaxed it but it's grown a few inches from then so that's why i want to just try and grow it out and see 
you will have to excuse the smoke <laughs> or the mist from my shower. I love hot, steamy water. <laughs> I also want to buy, um, actually I tried ordering the Mizani shampoo and conditioner, but it took too long. I wanted to wash my hair. It took too long to arrive, so I still haven't gotten it, but I'll do another um, hair routine with it and show you guys. But for now, I'm using this shampoo and conditioner um i have been using in fact my entire family uses it meaning my husband my child they use it and it works fine just that as i said i am quite intentional about the products and my hair growth and taking care of my hair so i believe i believe in mizani guys i believe in mizani products with my entire life and i want to start introducing like your luxury products as well in my hair routine i know they are a bit expensive but i feel like it's going to be worth it and we want long healthy hair one thing i will never do is keep long hair that's not healthy i will never do that i don't believe in that um so that's why i want to make sure that i take care of my hair as much as i possibly can so i can also see the rewards of that and it can grow so back to washing my hair <laughs> i don't know why it looks like that um uh, yeah let's wash my hair <laughs> um so Back to me starting a new job. I have been enjoying it so far. It has been two weeks, so I'm sure I'm still in the honeymoon stage. But I must say, I'm loving the environment. That is one thing that I have been praying for um, for so long is that I get a good working environment. As I had mentioned my in my previous job, the environment was also quite good, I won't lie. But the one before that one, it all <laughs> flames terrible. So the environment in this one has been quite good. I won't lie. I've been enjoying it. So I'm going in now with my conditioner. It's also from Organics. Um, yeah, I will try and and link all the products below um because i buy most of them from take a lot um so i'll link the the take a lot links below so that you can also see the prices i don't think the organic the organics um stuff is pricey i know mizani can be a bit pricey for instance the the i want to say the night cream was 300 and some odd. in fact both of them the night cream and the and the leave-in conditioner they were a bit expensive so when you've put in your your conditioner just try and leave it for about 10 minutes just so um it can really really sink in your hair strands because that's the whole part of putting in um conditioner is to moisturize your hair strands and protect them so try and leave it for like 10 minutes before you wash it out um i did stand in the shower for 10 minutes because i am wet and i don't want to get the floors wet um i haven't showered so after this i'm gonna go and shower like proper shower so i'm using my son's bathroom for this um video because the lighting is beautiful in this bathroom so i've showered um i did let it air dry a little bit i like doing that um i'm not sure what the benefits of that are <laughs> but for me it makes me feel better that i'm not gonna use so much heat to dry out the hair then i go in again with my mizani living conditioner i will link everything down below it's hair milk 
um it's a leave-in conditioner it is so good for your hair I, I can't emphasize enough how much this stuff is good for your hair that's why i believe in mizani products so much they leave my hair feeling soft and so moisturized the night cream makes your hair feel so moisturized and moist and soft i know my hair is it's it's damp here but trust me it is so moisturized as opposed to when i wasn't using all the stuff and now i can absolutely see and feel the difference i will not lie to you but i still stand by the fact that i don't think you should relax your hair at home um it did damage my hair and i had to cut it um as i had mentioned when i was coming from relaxing my hair at the salon please do not relax your hair at home rather just go to the salon pay it can be expensive i paid 700 rand i think yeah 700 rand to relax my hair and i think to for them to wash their hair i'm not really comfortable because they don't do this whole routine that i do as you can see it takes me about two days to wash my hair because i want to make sure that i fully fully wash it and also in the process it is protected i don't strip out all the good moisture out of my hair and scalp so you can wash your hair at home it for me it's better so you can try it but relaxing it's a no no relaxing at home rather just go relax it at the salon i will try and do a relaxing routine at the salon just to show you how i ask them to take care of my hair and make sure that they don't over process my hair i will try and do that one so as you can see my scalp is nice and clean and it looks moisturized i do a dry my hair a little bit as you can see here it's air dried and then i go in with uh, my hair dryer but before that i protect it from heat using this heat protector some people they don't really like it because they say that it makes their hair feel weird for me it is okay i will look for like i said i want to try and protect and uh, not protect i want to try and introduce like your luxury product as well on my hair routines so i want to look for a luxury hair uh, um, heat protector um i'm not sure of what brand but if you've got any recommendations you can recommend it down below so when i am drying out my hair using my hair dryer i don't put the hair dryer too close to my scalp because i don't want to burn my scalp for starters and i don't want to put too much stress on my hair cuticles because using heat on your hair stresses your hair cuticles and when they are stressed they do not perform well meaning your hair is not gonna grow like how it would if your hair cuticles are not stressed they are calm and collected <laughs> I treat my hair cuticles like they are people because they do all the work for me so i also use a brush just to brush out my hair i use a brush to brush out my hair i don't like i said i don't use a comb that often and even if when i use a comb my combs they've got big teeth hair um they've got big comb teeth so that it does not stress my growth i don't touch my hair growth at all i let it grow out can you see the comb that i'm using here i let my hair growth grow out with very little manipulation to it i try and not touch it as much as i possibly can because i don't 
think that's good for your for your hair growth nor is it good for your cuticles because you want to try and leave the cuticles alone as much as you possibly can then i go in with this uh, moisturizer it's also from mizani i will also link it down below i will link um everything again that i've used here down below except for the for the combs and the brushes i get all my brushes from tizkem tizkem is a variety of them so this is how my hair looks after it's been washed it's all nice and protected and neat and shiny thank you so much guys for what for watching this video if you haven't is it please subscribe please share please comment down below please like the video as well see you next time bye